hey, hey, spring buffet, simply Tara. Okay, special message time. Uh, I've done, um, I've done a reading. Oh, I've done a reading, and I got a package. Look what I got! Aren't they beautiful? Um, the Tarot of the Seventy Eight Doors, and um, awesome. They're beautiful, beautiful, absolutely beautiful, and. Um, I love them already. Now, I've been reading them intuitively. I've not uh, even had a chance to look at the book. Um, like I said, I'm more intuitive about reading. I, well, I am intuitive about reading. I go on what I get, what they give me. So, you know, but I love them. And I love my other ones. Oh, my goodness. But this is going to be a reading for the sign of Pisces. So if you have Pisces in your chart, this may be a reading for you. Cross watchers, it could be for you. They are timeless. All of my readings are timeless. So we're going to see what we get for Pisces tonight. Um, I probably won't be putting anything up for a couple days. Um, I was thinking about taking, you know, taking a couple days to rest and relax and you know just take a little time for myself but I'm sure that you know I usually <laughs> I take like that one or two days and then the, the messages just start coming so Okay, somebody's happy. They're feeling victorious. And it feels like they're, they feel like they can go forward with their life towards something that makes them happy. Pisces. Ooh. They got some form of news. It feels like, feels like good news. Get the moon card here. Your card. Okay. Feels like someone is, um, it's like they're, I'm drawn to the path. It's like someone's looking at their path. Um, clearly now. You know, They've been feeling like their back was against the wall is what I'm getting with that card. This feels like a higher power has been involved. Because someone's been working on themselves, it feels like, to balance their life. Someone's trying to balance their life. Yeah, they want a new beginning. They want a fresh start. It's like they want to start over. Can you tell us more, please? Can you tell us more, please? Can you tell us more for Pisces, please? Oh, my goodness. Is there any more for Pisces, please? Is there any more? Is there any more? Moving forward towards calmer water. Okay. Wanting to move forward towards happiness. Something's been put to Something has ended. Something's ended with the death card. And it feels like that with an ending, someone someone is going to make an offer to someone. There's been an ending that something's beginning. It's 
Something is beginning. Okay. Something is not as it seems. Something is not as it seems. There's something... Okay. Now I'm drawn back to the, the moon card. There's something that is not as it as it seems. Somebody turned her back on something. This is this is a soul connection. Somebody turned her back on a wish come true. Somebody turned her back on a wish come true. They made a choice. I'm drawn to the three cups. There's three people. Somebody made a choice. They let someone go. Something ended. This person is, um, feels like they're thinking about their money. like it's you Pisces it feels like it's you it feels like you're taking on that queen of um, and this is the other person queen of pen pentacles this is one of these okay it feels like you're taking on the queen of cups this feels like a higher power whether that you know feels like it's the, the, the divine but um, this is one of these two people Queen of Pentacles, someone that's nurturing and loving and um, caring, mothering. Hmm. Okay. For some of you, somebody turned their back on their wish come true, their family. For others of you, it's like Something died, and it's bringing forth a wish. You know, it's like with this person, they can have a family. Yes. You got to put yourself where you belong, so, yeah. They've got some choices. They may may have too many choices, feels like. But they definitely got a new beginning. They're getting their new beginning. Because they let something, it's like they've they done the right thing about letting something go. And they're getting their new beginning. They were guided to do so. And this is someone else that's involved. But this, one of these three people, see they're, they've done something, you know, and it feels like they're getting this wish. Hmm. Let's see if we get one of these. I love how these flow. Okay.
Someone may waste, may have a problem with wasting. It feels like someone's changing old patterns. They're they're taking old patterns that are negative and they're they're trying to make new positive patterns. They're trying to start new things that are positive. Somebody loves dogs as well. You know, it feels like whoever this is, by their choice that they made to let something go, just let it be. It feels like let peace be. It feels like they're, they're going to have bounty now. It's like things are going to turn around for them. If they keep on on their path and do what is for a higher good, this is a door they can open. See, there's the key. You know, and it's like staying on that, that doing what's right and, you know, not just thinking about ourselves, but other people and their happiness. And it, it feels like that, you know, Someone's going to have a bounty. You know, I'm also, I'm drawn back down here to this Ten of Cups. It feels like for someone, they've done something because they care about someone and they don't want to hurt a family. There's something about a family that they don't want to hurt. Because, you know, we got judgment karma what goes around comes around so you want to put out good karma you don't want to put out bad karma because you'll suffer from it you know it come back to you this feels like that um, if you go through this door you could have children you could have yeah I've drawn to the kids Someone could have um, children. That one wants to come out. Choose wisely your steps. Choose your steps wisely. You're being guided to choose them wisely. Okay, it looks like she's looking. It's like this person, whoever I'm talking to, is looking for signs. They're looking for signs because they they feel like um, they're going. It's like they're on their path. It's like they're trying to get on their path. If they're not on it, they're trying to get on it. And it's like they're searching because it's like they know there's more. There's more. They have to, you know, they got to go forward. They've got to. This is someone, or I feel like this is for many, that just have never felt like they really belonged here. Look at that. I just throw them out. Engagements. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Unrequited love, there is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. I think we got that for you the last time. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other and soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. Now, I don't know, you know, we've got three people, it feels like. So, one of these, there's just not enough attraction there. And, you know, it feels like one is an ex. 
it feels like that one is a soulmate. Now, if the soulmate is the ex, you know, sometimes soulmates come into our life to awaken us or to teach us something. Now, if the other person is the soulmate, well, yeah, strong connection, either way you look at it. But, it's a beautiful reading. If it does not resonate, though, don't try to make it fit your life. It's not going to be for everybody, but I do feel like it's for many. And give it a thumbs up. And, um, yeah. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. That little bell that will notify you every time that I upload. Let me know how you like the cards. They are beautiful. Somebody feels free. They feel free. There's a sense of freedom within that card. They feel like they, they, there's just a sense of they can fly now. They can do what they want now. They want to leave and go somewhere. They can do that. It's just, yeah, it's that type of sense to feel. But, have an awesome, awesome night. Bye.